What you're about to see is um, a trip to Seattle that we took yesterday. I have not introed this. I thought I did so in the car, but I have a whole lot of photos instead of video, so I may very well have just taken a photo of myself sitting in the car. However, David and I went up to Seattle overnight, drove up Saturday, came back Sunday in order to look for some tile and um, do a little antique shopping and go to some furniture or some building salvage yards. We initially planned on just having fun, but we ended up turning it into a reason to go because we need stuff for the new house. And I will show you in the next couple of days what we ended up finding. Not a ton of stuff, but some cool things. And um, so enjoy the video. Make sure you stick around for the giveaway. It's at the end. Get yourself a salmon. They cut off the heads for a reason, just FYI. All right, here's the flowers. I like the, that one looks very Halloween-y, doesn't it? There. Unless they ran ahead. 
owns butterflies. Cozy in Ballard. Its address is Seattle, but we're in Ballard. And just down the road, my husband's having a burger. But here's the shop. And they they uh, specialize in nice rustic yarns, which is lovely. And they get tweed from us. I just asked about this. And here's Jean Johnson, the owner. <laughs> Do you know my mother? Not law's name is Jean Johnston <laughs> with the T. <laughs> okay, <laughs> lots of lopey. Yeah, no yeah, and lots of uh, sure fair isle sweaters, which is super cool. And they have thread, which I found. That's my purchase for the day. Is thread back there in the corner? There's thread and needlepoint thread, which is pretty awesome. I didn't even go look at the sales section, which I should have done. All right, that is the tea cozy. Lots of good knitting inspiration. <laughs> Our next stop is called Second Use. I had to look at the name. And it's a salvage store, so we're going to go see if we can find anything interesting in the salvage store, like architectural salvage. Feel free to comment on this sewing machine and its title. It's a singer. Um, it's a newer one though, because it's got the drop in. Uh, right on the back. Uh, that is the Starbucks mothership right there, and we're about to go have a coffee over there. All right, we're going in. This used to be the Sears building. When I was a kid, we'd come here and shop every Christmas. And now, it is the headquarters of Starbucks. Food. Food. Swag.
that's not a tan, that's a crown. It's just flipping vast. I stop at Olympia. Just because it might be getting a little too low. Prizes are a skein of Studio Donegal Heather, some candy, chocolate, mint, and a licorice that is sort of mentholated. It's the coolest Italian flavor ever from the Italian grocery store. Uh, the Tea Cozy gave me this to give to you, a Tea Cozy button, download codes from Black Sheep Fiber Emporium, and stitch markers from Kokomo Yarns. The crocheters kit, or so my second winner, will be crochet gourd pins, gourd, uh, gourd style stitch markers from Kokomo Yarns. Some of my own personal hand dye, and you can go see where I dyed this that late earlier this year in green, because come on, we went to Seattle, it should be green. The same candies, from the Italian grocery store. I thought the Fiat candy was fun. And then a Kokomo yarns bag, <clears throat> plus downloads, download codes for, well, actually both of them are getting knit and crochet patterns, but for download codes also for some crochet patterns, one of which is my Afghan that I wrote, and then another one is for a little makeup makeup um, washcloth. It, I think, is already in the bag because I can't find it. So I think it's already in here. But those are the prizes. Those are the prizes for the people who write comments in episode 100 and what episode 101. I'm about to go upload both of those episodes. Well, I'm up uploading 101 tonight. Tomorrow will be one... 100 is going up tonight. 101 is going tomorrow. There. 
Okay.